Alright guys, what's up? We're at my place I haven't gone to, Half Price Books. And uh, I just looked through the dumpster, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Um, I didn't bring my camera because I forgot the memory card in it, but um, I just looked through everything and managed to save some stuff, some CD cases so I can replace them and stuff, so I'll show you when I get back home, so. Alright guys, what's up? Kamikaze, and I'm back home at base, uh, getting ready to show you guys what I found. Apparently this week was about um, PlayStation week, pretty much, for dumpster diving. I don't know, it, it's what it seemed like, because um, as you can see, I, you know, I, I actually finally went to a half price bookstore that was, that's close by me. It's the only, the only one pretty much by me that's in, you know, driving distance, which is like a 30 minute drive. There and back, so uh, I finally went there after a while because, uh, you know, before when it was in, you know, the winter, it was cold, snow on the ground. All that crap, and um, I'm busy, so I don't got time for that shit. But anyways, um, so this week is pretty much combining GameStop finds and half price book finds. Uh, I only went, like, let's see, I think three times. Uh, one day was actually a bust, which usually doesn't really happen to me that much. I mean, I know other for other dumpster divers, you know, they go there and they come back empty-handed. Usually I don't go empty-handed. Like, I'll grab... If I'm going, it's I'm I'm coming back with something. I'm not coming back on hand it. It's either boxes for shipping items or, you know, shipping supplies or um, you know, sometimes posters. Sometimes I just hit up a different place. Um, if you guys don't know, if you're new to the channel, uh, this is what it's about: dumpster diving, all that crap. I usually go to different stores, but I mainly go to GameStop and Half Price Books. Recently, I, I usually go to like electronic stores or, um, you know office doors but anyways um enough rambling on you guys are here for the dumpster finds as you guys uh you know watching this video and uh something different like i said this is about pretty much playstation week because everything i found was playstation related <clears throat> so let's get on to a couple of the gamestop finds first and then we'll do half price books right after so um i found this uh blaze blue Usually I say that like, I don't take promotional posters and stuff, but this one was actually this one actually looked pretty cool So I actually took it. There's two of them So that's kind of an awesome find and uh, I guess this is probably kind of late because they threw away the last of us This is a ps3 display box bundle. I think it's just a display box, but it's got the over slip or it's got a slip cover of uh, the last of us which i don't have so it's kind of cool to have this because i like i i haven't finished the game yet but i do have the last of us because i got it on sale for cheap so um <clears throat> i am playing that currently on my ps3 so that's awesome and um we'll get to the bags first because i want to kind of go through this this is kind of the playstation related kind of stuff um all right so first in the batch here uh you know just like usual DS cases, but again, um, I do take the cases, but I only take them if they have the Game Boy slot, the Game Boy Advance slot, because those are useful, uh, good for trades or, you know, uh, for games and stuff. Um, I did take this Wii case, complete Bakugan. I think I found one of these in the past, who knows, but just some DS cases, filler, a um, couple more DS cases here. So like I said, PlayStation. Uh, I went to the GameStop, found a bunch of PlayStation 2 cases. Now, I'm not sure, because one of these actually has a game in it. They're, most of them are empty, but th this one actually had NBA 2K13 for the PS3, which is in awesome shape. Uh, no scratches here. So as you can kind of see in the light. No scratches. That was an awesome random find because I thought most of these cases were empty. But they're all PS2 cases. So it's awesome because I'm starting to find loose PS2 games. Uh, I did find this Gears of War. Uh, this is a bonus disc, I believe. But I don't know. Gears of War 2 bonus disc. So I don't know what's on here. Probably like some DLC or something or behind the scenes. I have no clue. Comment below if you know. Uh, some more empty cases here. This is an empty case. 
Um, empty cases. Oh no, this one actually has the game. Oh wow. Um, so yeah, Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat uh, for the PlayStation 2. Complete. Uh, I believe this really doesn't have any scratches on it, so that's cool. And another empty case right here. Um, so yeah, pretty much empty cases. The next couple finds right here found an Xbox One Forza 5 slip cover. This is some like limited edition. I don't know, but I just grabbed it because it was Xbox One. Haven't found these in a while. Um, Wii stands. Uh, I got a box full of these actually, so I don't know if anyone really wants Wii stands. Um, another Wii thing related. I did find this Wii stand, Wii uh, display thing. Um, if you're a part of the Dumpster Diver, uh, Divers Nation, OK Chiefs Divers Nation page, um, I look on there um, once in a while, and I've seen a couple people actually find these. And uh, pretty much just this the sign. I think it's for a, a Wii U kiosk. As you can see, Wii U. Um, it's like hard plastic, but it's cool because I could probably make put some LEDs in it, make make a sign out of it or something. So that's cool. And uh, I came with some screws <clears throat> and uh, some instructions, some display instructions of uh, where which kind of kiosk display kind of thing you have. I don't even know if it's a for a kiosk, but it's for a display or something. Um, instructions on how you know put it together, which I don't have the other parts for. A uh, random piece of paper. So I thought that was kind of cool. Um, I was actually kind of looking forward to finding one of these, but I, I wasn't guaranteed I'd find one. Um, it is a little bent, but so that's my GameStop finds. So let's go to the next finds, which is um, uh, what you call it, uh, half price books. Now, if anyone actually goes to a half price bookstore, you know it's a bookstore and they sell some games there too, some PC software. They sell some things there, um, you know, CDs, music, CDs, soundtracks, all that jazz. And um, when you go to a half price bookstore, this is the reason why I kind of I like going to half price books, even though it is a drive away, you know, it takes like 30 minutes to get there and back. Um, actually, 30 minutes there, 30 minutes back. But, anyways. I forgot how why I love hash price books and I haven't started dumpster diving there because I started in the winter and I didn't go in the summer but this summer half price books is in my list to dumpster dive at and uh, you can never go empty handed even if you don't um, you can never go empty handed home even if you don't find any games you can always get CDs movies they have movies and um, but I usually look for the games but you know I, I've gotten movies there in the past. So this is what I got. Uh, we got a box full of PS2 games, PC games. Um, I'm gonna stack them out a little bit so you can see them better. So yeah, there was a the day I went on uh, to Half Price Books. Pretty much this whole week of dumpster diving. I forgot to mention in the beginning of the video. Um, it was a rainy week, so it was kind of shitty. But I wanted to get in because I had a feeling I was gonna find some pretty good stuff. During this week, dumpster diving at GameStop and Half Price Books. And you know, like I said, Half Price Books, you can never go empty-handed there. So I suggest you go to one of those if you have one. But uh, I did find a Transformers DVD. It is complete. And whatnot. And another thing, too, mentioning about the rain. Most of this stuff was water damage. But, I mean, like, like lightly. But I was managed to save it before, you know, any heavy water damage. Well, I just threw that DVD, but, um, so yeah, most of them are pretty cleaned up and, uh, you know, no more water on them. But anyways, I found a bunch of PC games. Um, I am a PC gamer, but I've never really owned a hard copy of anything, which I, you know, I, I like to, but PC game I really don't care for, but, um, for hard copies. But, uh, I got Hellgate. I got, uh, Civilization. Most of these are games for Windows, so apparently you can use your gamer tag to get achievements from them. Uh, we got Medal of Honor, Guild Wars, another Gears War Guild Wars uh, game, Eye of the Dorth of the North. I said Dorth of the North expansion. It's got a CD in it, but most of them have slipcovers, so that's why I'm not bothering to take it out. 
Um, two worlds. Uh, another one. Uh, Guild Wars. 2142 Battlefield. And uh, Bioshock, which is kind of nice because I haven't played this game yet, but now I got it for free. So, um, so yeah, random movies too. Uh, I took this just to have the CD case because I want to play some of my PlayStation games with them. So yeah, just a random one. Um, so yeah, I just grabbed some random like Japanese movies. I don't know, they're kind of interesting, and two of them are like sealed. Honestly, I don't think I'm going to watch them, but they look kind of cool to display. Oh, Jet Li actually might watch that one. That one looks kind of cool. Alright, so for the PlayStation 2 game. Like I said, PlayStation week for dumpster diving. Um, surprisingly, I found one of these um, PSP games, which is Madden. So that was interesting, I found that. Uh, again, a couple more just random CD music song CDs that I'm going to use for the jewel cases. Alright, so we got um, Rygar. Not complete, but you know, it's got the disc. Uh, Spyro Enter the Dragon. Damn, I just dropped all that game. Alright, let me do this again. Spyro Enter the Dragon. Complete. Uh, Virtual Fighter. Complete. Uh, Vice City. Uh, not complete, but it's the game. Terminator 3. Complete. Ace Combat 4. Complete. Uh, Family Feud. Oh, I forgot there was a Wii game in here. Uh, it's complete. Uh, NCAA Game Breaker. Oh no, this one's actually Iron Man. Oh wow. But yeah, I think I remember because I didn't. I found the game Iron Man, but I couldn't find the case. Uh, Tony Hawk Underground or American Wasteland. Uh, Need for Speed. I was kind of happy when I found this because I actually like this game. It's a pretty good game. Need for Speed 2. And I think I have it for the GameCube. And uh, Pac Man Fever. It's just complete. Alright guys, so this is pretty much my whole haul here. Um, I guess you could say this is PlayStation and uh, Wii um, week for dumpster diving. When I once since I only went like once or twice, but you know, half price books like I always said like I just said, can never go home empty handed. If you don't like going empty handed. I mean, even if you don't have a half price book, something similar to this place that sells movies and software and games. Awesome that I found all those PlayStation 2 games just, you know, beefed up my PS2 collection a little bit more. Wii U sign, probably gonna mod that, I don't know, maybe I make, might make a video about that, but uh, that's an awesome find. But yeah, thanks for watching guys, uh, make sure you hit that like button, lets me know, the thumbs up button down below, lets me know about the feedback, you guys are liking the videos. And uh, comment below what you guys think about this find, you think it was a pretty good haul for, you know, um... Not me not dumpster diving in a while. And uh, don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. This is what it's about. Dumpster diving. Uh, saving games from the dumpster um, before it sits in a landfill. That's what the point of this channel is about. To expose this. You know, this. Who needs to throw this all away? Nobody. Nobody. Somebody can have this. Some some kid with no games can have this. I don't know. But, you know, these games will end up somewhere. So, peace out.